It's so important to get out of your business, take time out and to connect with the alumni, connect with all the other people that are in, in the alumni and that's what today is about. Yeah, I was interested in the topic today, disruptive innovation. You're always facing the threat of innovation. You have to understand what it means, and where the main sources of innovation will come from and how it, how it affects your business or the service you're providing. I did the programme in 2014 and by coming back here today, it reminds me of why I came in the first place. It reminds me of the five months that I did when I did the 2014 programme. So coming back is a great opportunity today to rekindle old friendships and to um, to learn again. Uh, this is my first alumni event. I was on ALP 2016. Uh, so certainly so far it's been very engaging, very interesting. Today has been great just to really get back into it, get your head back in the education type zone, uh, understand a little more about uh, disruptive innovation and things that you don't normally think about on a day to day basis. So we've uh, talked about an idea um, called disruptive innovation, which is really a theory about why it is that incumbents that seemingly have all the advantages, resources, market power, brands, etc., oftentimes struggle in the face of certain types of market and technological change. So we looked at the case of Netflix versus Blockbuster, their classic disruption of, of Blockbuster's brick and mortar, and we got to see how they used a innovative business model to take on Blockbuster. And I mean, now, of course, Netflix is struggling with a whole bunch of its own questions to deal with, and the question is, you know, does, does the disruptor become the disruptee at some point? So there's a lot of energy, there's a lot of enthusiasm, there's a lot of uh, you know kind of rigorous debate and pushing the ideas forward and I think that's that's a great thing. During the five months you, you're bringing back a whole load of learning back to your colleagues and you think no, I can do that again and this is just a one day a bite-sized chunk that I can come back and relearn.